Hey everyone, this is Michael again. I'm back. Uh, I know I haven't done a video uh, since two weeks, but you know I've been really busy with you know stuff and been enjoying the summer, hanging with some friends. Yeah, uh, I just want to you know go out some more to spend the last few days of summer, cause the kids. Next week, the kids and the uh, teens go back to school, and you know all that. And the day the kid, those kids and teens go back to school, I'm gonna be starting my first job, which I hope it's pretty cool. Um, but today, I'm going to review the Flow TV personal television. So let's get to it. Okay, so this is the Flow TV personal television. Uh, got it as a graduation present, and I have had it for a month, and it's really fun. Uh, I've been playing around with this, and you know I enjoy it. Um, it's got up here. It's got a uh, how much battery you have already. I have a full battery so I charged it last night um, has the power button right here it's got the headphone jack right here the volume control uh, the mute button right here and the uh, thing where you can plug it in and it charges it uh, I'll, I'll, I think it's a USB um, and the screen is a 3.5 inch touch screen um, yeah. and back here you have a stand now, and you could adjust the angle to it and just watch you know your TV like this your flow TV like this and you know, so you don't have to hold it um, so yeah. Um, this is available, um, in, uh, stores like Best Buy, you know, PC Richards, the electronic stores, Radio Shack, all that. But, you could get them there. Uh, and it also, it's also available if you have Verizon or AT&T, uh, the mobile phones. Because this is mobile TV. Um, on, but on a, you know, personal television. So I'm going to turn it on. And it says tap to wake up. Tap it. Showing Comedy Central. Yeah, there you go. Picture is crystal clear. Uh, sometimes it could come out. Let me adjust the volume right here. You're showing Reno 911. <laughs> um, I don't watch the show though. But um, uh, but um, sometimes the picture could come out very pixely, cause I think it's like it could. The picture comes from like yeah, it just is like from satellite TV, think like that. Um, but yeah, you could touch, you could go up and down with this TV, see, there you go, like that, you could choose which channel you want, let's say, MTV, or as I would call it, RTV, reality television, because they show nothing but reality crappy TV shows, like the freaking Jersey Shore, fucking Jersey Shore, I hate that show, and, you know, all kinds of crappy reality TV shows but if you touch this right here I don't know if you can see it there's a little button right over here touch that it shows the guide and it shows uh, the channels you have you got MTV, MSNBC, Nickelodeon, Disney Channel uh, Comedy Central like I showed you it's got ESPN, 
uh, oh, you can move up and down with this uh, any way you want. It's got NBC to go, Fox Mobile, CBS Mobile, ABC. Um, it's got CNN. Also got Adult Swim, but it doesn't start until 10 o'clock at night. You got Crackle, which is a movie channel, a uh, uh, mobile movie channel where you can watch uh, movies from uh, the Sony library, the Sony Pictures library. You know, it's Columbia Trist, Columbia Tristar formerly. Um, it's got Fox News Channel, uh, Two Point Flow, uh, which is their little mobile TV channel, Discovery Channel, CNBC. And it's all the channels, but I heard they're going to be adding some more soon in the future. And also, it says the time right here. You can move the time. Like you see the time right there. Uh, oops. Um, see the time right there. You can actually move it, and it goes to a different time. See, I'm on 11 o'clock right now. Yeah, you can watch. You know, you could flip through this and you know look for your favorite shows and watch. And if it comes on at that time, you could just watch it. Also, it has uh, a timer. Uh, you could set. Oh, this is a no. Sorry, this is not the timer. It's uh, you see programs in the near future. You could go today, tomorrow, or you know any day, and set the time to it. Also, to see if your favorite shows are on. And just show the guide at this time. Yeah. Also, it has a. Uh, it has settings. It has reminders where you can set what time your favorite show goes on. Uh, it's also got parental parental controls to control like you know like TV 14, TV MA, like if you have kids or stuff like that. Also has device options. Uh, as channel change, the brightness and factory reset. And it has the device intro, where it, sh where it shows you how much battery you have. It has shows 95. And the signal strength, I have weak signal, uh, but it's still good. Software is software version is 1.0. Also has subscription help and legal information. Yeah, it's cool. So, so yeah, it's pretty cool. Also, the sound on this is amazing. It's crystal, cl it's crisp, it's clear. It's like it sounds like, you know, it sounds very good. It's not, it's better than you know, right re the regular TV sounds or like that. If you have stereo or you know, anything like that. Also, if you hear with the headphone jack, you know, with the headphones, it's really clear. Even when you watch a movie on here, it sounds like you're in the movie theater, which is really, really cool. Um, sounds sounds like the sound has been remastered. Um, but, yeah, it's, this is a cool device. And back here, I forgot to show back here. You get the speakers. I think a sign that uh, we need to do anything we can to get this speakers number back there. Uh, uh, higher. We need to be creating more jobs. So yeah. So we bring that but right the now. only flaw, the only flaw with this device is sometimes when you leave it off, uh, and you know, like for a couple of hours or basically all night, uh, you may have to restart the device where it says uh, searching for signal if it takes too long. You have to use the power button and hold it down, and then press it back on again, and you know, cl you know, click agree. But yeah, this is a cool device. Uh, highly recommend it. Uh, so yeah, so that's the review of the Flow TV personal television. Um, also, I got it. I got the this for a year I paid uh, for a year I have a free for a year so uh, sorry about that and then uh, I have it free
free till next July of next year, and I get to pay, uh, I think, uh, $175, I think, yeah, so, uh, yeah, it's a cool device, like I said, highly recommend you get it, if you like it, it's all mobile TV, so, it's different from cable. Uh, so that's it for this review. Thank you all for watching, and until the next video, I'll see you all later.